All right, I'm um, going to try to do another Sudoku from uh, Mark and Simon cracking the cryptic today. So normal Sudoku rules apply. Digits must sum within cages to the clue in the top left. Digits long an arrow. Digits cannot repeat in a cage. Digits long an arrow sum to the digit in the circle. And self separated by a knight's move, so something like that or something like that uh, cannot have the same digit. Okay. Uh, well, three, ser three cell arrow can't have anything larger than a six in it. This has to be at least six. Can't be an eight by the knight's move rule. So we have a nice big cage here, eight cells, and digits cannot repeat. So this is all the digits, one through nine, minus one of the digits. And if it was one through nine, it would sum to 45. So to get to 37, removing only one digit, we need to get rid of an eight. So this is all the digits, not including eight. And that means there is an eight here. Do we know anything about these two cells? because these two cells can't appear in the cage, so they have to be somewhere in here. If you look at this cell, can't go in the cage, can't go here by knight's move, can't go here by knight's move. So this cell is also blue, and therefore can't be an eight, because you can't have an eight here. Can't do as much with this one by knight's move, so we'll leave that one for now. Do we know anything about this arrow? If this is an eight, we have quite a few options. One, seven, two, six, three, five. Yeah. If this is the eight, it would have to be a one and a nine. So this is either eight or nine. Well, this is small, but either way, we don't have a four uh, in these three cells. If it's a nine, we know it's eight, one. If it's an eight, you couldn't put a four because you would need two of them. And that breaks it up. So there's definitely a four in here which means there's definitely not a four in those two. I mean, this is kind of interesting. This blue cell can't see any of these. If we could like prove this isn't a nine, this has to have a one on it. This couldn't be a one. Then you couldn't have a one and this couldn't be a nine. Maybe we need to do something like that. Oh, okay. Well, these five cells, all see each other. Uh, so the minimum they could be is one, two, three, four, five, which adds up to 15. Um, this has to be six, seven, or nine. So if you need to get to at least 15 here, if it's a six, it could be as high as nine. If this is a nine, this can go as low as six. Can't be an eight by Sudoku. Now these five cells, they have to have a one on them. I think they do, right? If you didn't have a one, you'd have two, three, four, five, six. That sums to 20, and you can't do that because you have to also be able to represent that sum with two cells. Uh, you couldn't put any two digits in here to sum to 20. The max is 9 and 9, which breaks the doku, but is only 18 anyways. So this actually has to have a 1 on it somewhere. Ah, okay. Yeah, nice. 8 cell cage is either 1, 2, 5, or 1, 3, 4, but it definitely has a 1. And you'll notice, actually, this arrow uh, sees this whole cage. This cell sees these two by Sudoku, this by Knight's Move. This one sees these two by Sudoku, and this one by Knight's Move. So there is no one here, because that would preclude a one from existing in the eight cage. We knew there was a one on, this, on these five cells, so it now has to be over here. Now, this cell, wherever the one is up here, is going to see it. So this blue cell can no longer be a one. And what that means is this can't be a 9, because in order for this to be a 9, you have to put the 8 here, you need a 1, can't do that. Oops, so this is an 8, this is not an 8, and actually we know that these two are the same color, same value. Couldn't have a 9 on these. Okay, but you definitely have a 9 in that part of the cage. Oh, if this can't have a 1, then the highest it could go is 7. I don't even know if all these values are possible. Oh, I have an idea. Okay, so this cage is either, we said, 1, 2, 5, 
or one, three, four. I'm just writing them up here so I can visualize it a little bit. Um, that's what goes in this eight cage, one of these two options. So in order to get a six here, you would have to do two and four, and that actually breaks both options. If you put two and four here and put a six, that's the only way you can get to six here. Um, there's no way to fill out this eight cage. So that's not a six. Oh, okay, well, let's think about this. Could this be a six? No. You'd have to have one, two, three. So you'd have to put four or five here. Anything larger goes above nine. Oh, and we said four and five doesn't work. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if you put a six here, force two, one, two, three, that forces a four or five here and a nine here. Um, but that four or five breaks the eight cage because then you cannot use either option. So this can't be four or five. This can't be six. Oh, wait a second. This has to sum to 16 now. Can you sum to 16 five digits with a seven? No. Right, 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 because we said one, two, three, four, and a seven. 17. So this doesn't have a seven on it. This has to have a one on it. So it's either one, two, four, or if it's a nine, you could do one, two, six, or one, three, five. This is one, two, six. It gives you a nine here, a seven here. You'd have to have three, four, and then you have one, two, five up here, and that's fine. If it's one, three, five, uh, it can't be one, three, five, because then there's no way to get to seven over here. You've used up all the odd digits, so you can't sum to an odd number. So I'll do this kind of weird, but this three cell arrow over here is either one, two, four for seven, or one, three, five, sorry, not one, three, five, uh, one, two, six for nine, right? Because it has to have a one, so you couldn't do two, three, four for the nine. You know, one, two, six, or one, three, five. And we said one, three, five doesn't work because it breaks the seven over here. Okay, so what that means is there's definitely a two here, and there's definitely no three and no five. If this is one, two, four, or seven, nine over here would have to be three, six. I know I'm doing some very unconventional pencil marking here, but bear with me. Uh, that was, so if it, this is one, two, four, or seven. This is a nine, so you'd have to do three six with the remaining numbers. That's fine, that doesn't break the eight cage. If this is one, two, six for a nine, then you have a seven here. This has to be three, four. Okay, so either way, this has a three. And then the other option is four, six. Okay, so similarly, it has no five and no two. Oh, well, that tells us this cage, right? So this can't have a three which means it also can't have a four, it has to be a one, two, five. Okay. I think we can close that out. We got these reduced enough. This can't be a two by the Knight's move rule. These must be five, seven, five, seven, and nine. Uh, okay, we have a five, seven, nine triple here, which means the five is definitely here. So it is not here. Mm -hmm. Where do we go from here? If we want to look at eights. It's the only digit we have two of, so <laughs> seems like a decent option. Um, where can eight go here? Except it can't go here by knight's move. Can you put an eight in this cage? Well, not in any of these. Could you put an eight here? Eight and seven is 15. Oh, no, it's too much because you couldn't put two ones in here. Okay, so you can't have an eight in the cage. Could you have a seven with a nine? That'd be 16. No, you would need, yeah. So this has to be from the digits less than six. Okay, let's go back to the eights for a second. So down here, I think eight can go in any of these. Up here, eight has to go in row one. Can't go here by knight's move, which means it's here. Can only have eight on this line if this is a nine and it's paired with a one. Oh, but we, well, we can't have a one here because it, wherever the one is on this three, uh, three cell arrow, it's gonna see this cell. So this can't be a one, which means this can't be an eight. This cell cannot be an eight. If this is an eight, it sees all three of these cells in the box below it, so there's nowhere left to put an eight. So this cell cannot be an eight. 
What about over here? Have to be one of these. I don't think Knight's move is reaching that far, so I don't think I can break that down anymore. What about up here? Can't go in the top row because there's definitely one here. So any of these, I think. And then down here, I think any of these can be an eight. Except this one, maybe. Yeah, because this if, it, if this is an eight, it sees all three of these cells in the box eight. So this can't be an eight. What about up here? This cell be an eight? No. If this cell was an eight, it sees all three of these. So there's nowhere left to put an eight. Okay, so that can't be an eight. I wonder if it's like a chain reaction all the way around. I'm tempted to pick one of these to start with and just see what happens. These seem a little less impactful. I mean, the most impact is this one. Well, it would force one here. Which forces one here. Blocks that one. I'm thinking about choosing one of these because there's this arrow involved as well. It would give us a little bit more information. So let's see. Could this be the 8? I mean, this can't be an 8. This can't be an 8 by uh, Knight's move. So this is an 8. No 8 here. This is an 8. None of those are 8. This one by Knight's move. So this is an 8. Ah, there it is. Cool. So this is not an eight, and indeed this is the eight. This is two and six. There's no six here. This is the five, this is the two, this is the one. One in here. No seven here means that this is a seven. Uh, so there's definitely a seven down here. No eight in either of these because this is the eight. I guess I should finish my eights. Not an eight. Well, I should do as much work as I can on the eights. Can't have a one here. Could you get a six on this? Six and nine is 15. No, you can't have a six. Can you have a five? Five and nine is 14. You would need one and two. Okay, so you could have a five, not in these cells. This can't be a two. Oh, actually, you can't have a two at all in here now, so you couldn't have a five. So these are a three, four pair. This then has to be a one. Okay, cool. That's not a one by Sudoku, so it must be here. And then there's a one somewhere in there. Up here, there's a one in one of those. Down here, there's a one in one of those. Ah, blue can't be one. Two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Except they have to sum to eight, so if this can't be a one, this can't be a seven. Definitely a two up here. Oh, right, we have a three, four pair here, so there's no three or four here. Oh, here we go. Two and six go here. Either way, they either orientation, two, six, or six, two, they both see this sum. So this can't be a two nor a six, uh, which means this can't be a two nor a six. You could say the same thing about this cell. Can't be a two nor a six or a one. Actually, can't have a one in this whole column. Couldn't have a nine over here or a one. Do a little bit of cleanup on this. Two, six. So this also is two, five, six, seven. This is two, five, six, seven. Oh, well, this is not a two or six because those go here. What about down here? One could go in these except for that one. Oh, and one can't go here. It can't be the head of an arrow cell because you can have two digits that sum to one. So one is in the four corners here. It's in one of these two cells here because I can't go here by night's move, which means on this row, this is the only place for a one. So it must be a one. This must be a seven. This is a seven. This is a one. This is not a one. No one down here. No one in here. No seven in here. No seven in here. So 
7, that's not a 7, so one of these is a 7, and one of these is a 7. 3, 5, and 7, except 7 is not here. 4. 5 has to be in one of these corners. Oh, that's cool. So 2 can't go there by nice move. 2 must be down here. We know 2 is here, so 2 must go here, but it can't go here by night's move twice. So that's a 2. There's a 2 here. Either place we put a 2 here, it's going to see this cell, so that's not a 2. Now this 2 sees here, so that's a 6. That's a 2. No 2 here. No 6 here. Ah, so 2 has been reduced to one of these two cells. And what about down here? 2 could go in here. Except it can't go in either of these. 2 has to go in one of these two. Either way, it sees both of these cells. And we know 2 has to go down here, so it can't go down here. So 2 must go up here. Therefore, 2 cannot go here. And this is the only place 2 can go in this box. Now, 2 can't go here by Knight's move, so this must be the 2. This must not be a 2. This is not a 2. This is the only place left for the 2 in that column. This is the only place left for a 7 in that column. No 7 here. Got a 5, 6 pair, so there's no 5 or 6 in here. 3, 4, 9 triple, which means this cannot be 3 or, five, uh, three or 4. So this must be 5, no 5 here, which means this must be 5, or 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9. 9 sees this cell, so that's the 5, that's the 9. These are what, 7 and 6. Maybe we want to look at this row, it's pretty busy. Um, 1, 2... Guess that could be three or four. These could not be three or four. Okay, so that's interesting. We have three, four pair here. Uh, so these must be what, five and six. So there's no five down here. So these must be, well, two and eight have to be these two, which leaves only a nine. Nice. Nine has to go here somewhere or here. Ah, nice. Okay, so in this column, where does 9 go? Can't go here by Knight's Move, can't go here by Sudoku, can't go here by Sudoku, can't go here by Knight's Move, can't go here by Sudoku. That's the only place for the 9. No 9 here. Forces a 9 here. Forces a 9 here, but it can't be here by Knight's Move. Has to go in one of those on this side. Okay, let's finish filling this out. So these can be three or four, or they could be six. Well, this one can't be six. So this is the only place for the six then. Let's color these three fours. We'll do lemon lime. So this can't be lime. Sorry, can't be lemon, must be lime. This one can't be lime. Oh, duh. I just happened to catch this one. Uh, nine can't go on an arrow, because what would you put here? So nine has to go here by Sudoku. Can't go here because it can't be in a line. Can't go here by Knight's move. Makes this the nine. No nine here. No nine here. This can't be a 7, can't be a 9, can't be an 8, it has to be 6 or less. This has got to be pretty small then, what's on this arrow. Which means this can be, well, you could have a 1 here, and you could have a 2 here at the smallest. So if that's a 1, this could be 2, 3, 4, or 5, and if that's a 2, this could be, 
Yeah, so three and four see both of these cells. So you can't have a three nor a four on here. Oh, wait a second. This sees the two. This, this can only be a one. Which means that's not a one. That's not a one. That is a one. That's either a three or a six. Nah, and this can't be a five. Must be a two. Yeah, I was right. This did have to be pretty. Oops, did have to be pretty, pretty small. Three. We could do some Sudoku here. Two, eight. No eight here. No eight here by Knight's move, which means eight has to be in this bottom row. So it's not here. Must be here. Clean up some pencil marks. Oh, well, you can't be a three. Green has to be in one of those four. Actually, green has to be down here. And yellow must be up here, can't be here. Which means the other green has to be up here. And yeah, so this has to be green. And yellow has to go over here. Let's look at this column, it's pretty busy. We need four, five, six, eight. So this could be four, can't be five, could be six, could be eight. This one's five, six, this one could be four, five, or six. I think this could be any of them. Definitely a seven here. What else can we do with sevens? There's definitely a seven here. Oh, this has to be seven. It's the only place in this row where seven could go, which means seven has to go here. Uh, we said this is the only place where the green cell could go, right? So this has to be a three, four. Could not possibly be a seven. And so basically you can ask where does seven go in this column? We said it can't go there. This has to be green, which is three, four. Can't go here because of knights move twice. Can't go here because there's a seven in this box. Can't go here by Sudoku. So this must be seven. That means what's remaining in here is the four, five, six, eight. This can't be a five, nor an eight. No, this can't be a four. We already have three and four placed in this column. So this as well as five, six, eight, but cannot be a five. Could be a six or an eight. These are three, four, six. Oh, let's look at these two. Three, four, and five. And this can't be a five because wherever the five goes here, it's gonna see this. Which means you must be a five and are therefore not yellow. Now we've got our two yellows placed. Kinda of knew that already, but this is yellow, which means it's not eight. It has to be three or four. Which means oh no, this must be the eight. Which means this must be the eight. Oh, well, here's something that we had for a while. This has to be the 3-4 we said, which is seeing this by Knight's move. So that's not the green, which means this can't be the 6 because it must be the green. And that leaves only a 6 here. Now we have to place a 6 here. Can't go here by Knight's move, so this must be a 6. That sees this cell, so that can't be a 6. Must be the 5. That must be the 6 which means you have to have a six down here, making that a four. This can't be a six or a four, so that's a five. This can't be a four, so that's a nine. And then the only thing left in this row is a five. This can't be yellow, which means this can't be green. This must be a nine. And this must be the other three, four, and be green. This must be a five. This must be a nine. No four five here. This can't be a five by Sudoku. Now this can't be a six, so this must be the six. The eight must go here. This must be the four. And I believe that's gonna mean yellow is four. Which means green is a three. And why not? I'll color these in. 
This can't be a 6 by knight's move twice, so this is the 6, makes that the 7, makes that a 6, and makes that a 7. And we're done. 49 minutes. Not bad. Alright, just doing a little double checking, make sure I didn't make any mistakes. Or at least Simon and I made the same mistakes, I suppose. I think this looks good.